Hello there, I'm Aldra Hill, and welcome to Hearts of Iron Fork, uh, collab with Madry Bread. Say hello. Fuck you. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I like the idea now of someone, like, someone doesn't notice the first episode, and they come in on the second, they're like, oh, what's this? And they click it, and their first impression of me, fuck you. <laughs> like, I don't wow, know why what? I decided to come in this piece of shit channel. <laughs> and then just, like, you just disconnected from your channel. Jesus. I contacted you. <laughs> You really not, you should do that. You should just start contacting a bunch of YouTubers, like really get excited, get into a collab. They're just like, fuck you, and then never talk to them yeah. again. Yeah, like the first Dash episode comes in, they start recording, they're like, hey guys, I'm here with Madrid Brand, and I'm like, what did you just say to me? No, don't don't pretend you didn't say something to start the episode. What did you just say to me? Just pretend like they really offended me. <laughs> me like pretend pretend like they've come you've like they've attacked you, like they've come to your team speak, like, get out of my channel. It's like this is my team speak. Like, I'll be I'll be like Wait, who, hello? How, how did you get into my Discord? Who are you? <laughs> are you are you recording a Let's Play? What the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> oh, that's mean. All right. Oh my god, I want to do it now. So you're gonna need to find one YouTuber to ruin his dreams in life. Well, yeah. let me know how that goes. Maybe the, maybe you'll be that. Well, now you know the plan, so I can't do that. <laughs> all, right, all, all right, you can you'll, you'll love me and hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. So we're Hearts of Iron Foring. We are Turkey and Greece. You're fascist. I will be fascist maybe one day, if I, you know, if I hope yeah. and pray. I like it. My country's so small, and it's on so many lines. So if you zoom out to try and see the name of my country, it's just I, this. Yeah, I can. Vertical I can. Oh, there, blur. Oh, there it is. Yeah, if I turn my head on the side, I can. Oh, there it is. National. Well, no, where is it? It's only, if you zoom National in too much, it disappears. National Union of Greece. It's only there for like four mouse wheel turns. Once you get too close, it just disappears. It's That's awful sad. because, like, it's it's like a sentence. My country name is a full sentence. <laughs> oh, that's sad. All right, I'm ready to get going when you are. Awesome. So I am gonna do the very first thing, and I think I think I've lost. We made a bet, uh, for those who didn't see last episode, that the I said that Republic and Spain would win. Madrid said that uh, Nationalists would win, and uh, yeah, I lose. So you get a you get a civilian factory. So I'm gonna. Yeah, I, I need it. I need some steel. So, oh, you don't have any steel to trade. <laughs> Do I not? Wait, oh no, no, it's okay. It's, it's just I've clicked the oh, wrong. Oh man, it's... I'm out of steel. Wow, I didn't even realize. Nah, oh, you can you give me loads of steel. There we go. Okay, ready. I need steel. Oh, you got. There we go. I'm gonna get take six of your steel, and I'm gonna get and you can get a civilian factory. There you go. Awesome. I'm happy with it. And I'm just going to go back to building crap tons of infantry equipment because I am at a 10k deficit. Wow, I'm actually at eight factories now. Seven. I just lowered to seven civilian factories. That's right. actually better than I expected. Uh, what am I on? Civi oh, God, I'm on civilian economy. Yeah, we all are. But as soon as... Once... Uh, what, what do you need to change? What does it need to be? It needs to be 15%. Uh, I think it's 15 for war economy. Yeah. Is that what and you're thinking? We're, and we're going to be the ones to, to push it up. Don't you worry. As soon as I turn fascist, we're going to justify I'm Bulgaria, Romania, and Yugoslavia at once. Okay, so should I save up some political points for this? How, okay, how many am I going to need for that? Let me check. Um, um, yeah, how many do you need? 40, I think they're all 49. Nice, so we, uh, we're going to just need like 150. That's, that's, okay. that's fine. Well, I'm we, almost we at 150 now, so if you end up going... Uh, if you end up hitting fascism real fast, then I'm not even going to spend it. But. I've got 111, so I will. I think I, I think I might try and save it as well. Yeah, let's save up, and if we if we hit like I don't know, 200, 200 215, you're still not fascist, which I doubt it'll take that long. Then we I might want to so. just spend it on something, you know? Yeah, yeah. It's just I don't want to spend it, and then two turns later we're ready to justify. And then we and then we lose like half a year of no, waiting to do no. all the justifications. But the thing and is, stuff. as long as we do it before the Japanese Sino War or whatever it's called, and as long as we take all these territories at once, we're going to be amazing. Well, we should decide what territories we get. Yeah, yeah. Who wants to annex what here? I think uh, maybe a good idea. You know where um, you see Poland, right? You see how Poland? Uh, like, yes. It dips down into Romania like a little tail. It's like a, it's like it's yeah. just dipping its toe into the sea of Romania. Like, yeah. What about using that as the line? The the line for what? Like the line of division. So south of that, I get east of it. You get west of it. Oh, I got you. I got you. So we're cutting kind of down the halfway point of Romania and Bulgaria. Yeah, you're gonna get shit tons of Yugoslavia, but I mean. Ooh, you're getting the oil. You'll need it for your tanks. I'm getting loads wait, of oil. How, 
How much oil do heavy tanks use, actually? Um, not much, but I need some. And let me I check. mean, we're both going to need oil for planes, but if I'm going to if I'm going to trade for one. oil, I'd rather trade it with you than trade it with someone else. Yeah, it's just one. It's just one oil, and the play, uh, fighter two at nineteen forty takes two oil. So okay. it, I, I, the forty should be enough. And by the time you know we're really attacking, I can take a rock and a rand anyway. So I need to get. All right. So if I'm taking the left side of Bulgaria, I'm gonna I'm gonna catch up to you in chromium. Mm. Oh no, that's that's. Oh no, no, wait, Yugoslavia. I keep thinking. Yeah. God, I keep forgetting Bulgaria has, is just garbage when it comes to resources. Well, because I because I'll probably need more chromium eventually. Then you can give me the chromium and trade it for me, and I can give you the oil, yeah. and everybody will be happy. God, I really hope we end up taking Yugoslavia one day because. Oh no, we will. We'll take it in the same war as Bulgaria and Romania, because no one will defend yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. And no oh, one loves right, them. Right, right, right. It, I mean, unless unless Italy does something wacky with the uh, with it not being historical focus, because yeah, it's possible. I mean, if they try to make their own faction, they'll ally with Yugoslavia. They will. Uh, they got they're doing triumph in Africa right now, so that's fine. All oh, right, uh, I forgot you can check that stuff. Uh, oh god, I just realized. What triumph in Africa with their national focus? The next one is about whether or not they support Yugoslavia or claim it. Oh god. If they befriend it, it, uh what do they get? They don't get they don't have to be friends with them, but they get increased relation. And the next one is Albanian occupation, and that's basically just like you will join me or you will die. They don't What the fuck is France doing? What are they doing? <laughs> they're getting they're getting air doctrine. Hey man, you gotta defend that airspace. There's so much Okay, air. so they they got air focus. Fighter focus, then air doctrine. Why is that their top priority? Like kill some forts. They're, Shit. They're collapsing government. Oh yeah. Oh, their focus. Their national focus is fifteen percent. Not national focus. Unity. It's so bad. Why Ooh. don't they? Why aren't they at least like going? I don't know. Industrial. I don't know. Something useful yeah. early on. Do they really need that? Do they really need planes that badly? Oh my God. We should stage a communist coup in France. Oh my God. I want to make a fascist coup. <laughs> no, a communist coup no in France. No point. No point. No, then... Mm, well, ooh, no, hang on. Here we go. I have a plan. Okay? What? I'm going to pause for this. Hang on. This is amazing. We are both going to support a communist coup in France, right? All right. Not yet. When we get... Because we need the political power because it costs so much. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, no, it takes too much equipment. Okay, we'll do it later in the game. Okay, we'll support a communist coup in France because they already have 30% communism, right? They'll get yeah. a communist coup, and if they win, then they'll be a communist. They'll join the common term of the Soviet Union, and when Germany attacks them, they'll have to attack Russia, which weakening the both of them. I like that idea. Right? I bet it'll never happen like that, but... <laughs> Actually, here's a question. Yeah. Can you do a uh, Can you do a non-aligned coup? <laughs> I would assume not, I right? Think so. Because I really want to see what happens. The world's dominated by this new ideology of non-aligned. <laughs> the world has been taken, been taken by storm by eh, whatever's good policy. <laughs> Hitler has been overthrown by a monarchist. <laughs> I can only assume non-aligned in most countries is. Probably monarchy. Well, your mind is the CHP, the Kumhurit Halk Partiz Partizi. That means non-partisan. Yeah, basically it means like the non-partisan collective, doesn't it? I think. Yeah, I, I totally know Turkish. The neutrals win. Yeah. Tell my wife I said hello. <laughs> like that, like that Shit, dated what, Futurama reference. Oh, what was that from? That was Futurama. Yeah, I love it. Was. That's a dated reference for you. Yeah. I right now I'm holding in. out on some ahead of time. I'm I'm holding out on uh, a research slot to see to bring down my ahead of time penalty as much as I can on improved machine tools. Yeah, smart man. Actually, I, I, what's I more bonus. immediately use what's more immediately useful? Improved machine tools or concentrated industry? Um so improved machine tools increases efficiency cap by ten percent and concentrated yeah. industry is twenty percent factory output. So if you go to your factories, a factory is seven point one five, right? Yeah. So and it ramp and it ramps it ramps up to a fit and you have a fifty five percent efficiency. So, the yeah. Oh god, what is it? No, the base output's five, and you get fifty five percent efficiency. So a ten percent increase of efficiency would be 0.5 uh, more production, but twenty percent more factory output would be 
one more, but then that'd be 55% of one more, so it'd be 0.55. So, concentrated industry is better, and I've chosen the wrong one to focus on. Like, I went machine tools. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> is this the first time you've done the math on that? It is literally the first time I've done the math on that. I just. Well, just... hey, it's a good thing we figured this out early. Right? Right. Um, yeah. Because usually I go machine tools first. Now I know that I do get a slight advantage in the other one first. Uh, also, um, actually, it looks like if I wait the full 30 days, I am going to get rid of the ahead of time bonus on this. Sweet. Nice. Um, or at least get very, very close to it. Um, I just finished my military youth and went on to paramilitarism for the division training time. Nice. Yeah, you just try and get that faction as soon as you can for ideological yeah, I'm real close to it. The next one after this should be the one where I make a faction. Nice. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm on arm and effort too. I'll go the three next, and then I will go construction efforts to get those civ factories. I think it's safe to say that no one's joining our faction but us until oh, we yeah. already have conquered most of the world just because the Axis is better. Yeah, but I don't want anyone joining our faction. No one else can have it but us. I'll take everything no, I, east. I don't want Hitler in charge of us. I want to uh, be in charge of us. I want Hitler to, like, you know, be like the house slave in Istanbul. Exactly. We'll take him over later. Yeah, that will be fine. We can have a democratic coup in Germany, maybe. Ooh. Actually, no, we can't, we can't support coups for... Can we support coups for governments that we aren't uh, the same as? I don't remember. Yes. Oh, but... right, right. The, the thing that's specific to your government type is boost pop, uh, party popularity, right? Yeah. But we can't do that because uh, other ideologies and your ideologies' popularity can't be boosted because we're, I'm currently neutral. Ugh. Yeah. Boost non-aligned. Hand out, walk around handing out pamphlets that are like... <laughs> You know, people care a little bit too much. What do nowadays. you say we all just go have a drink in the pub? <laughs> Calm down. There's no need for this fascism malarkey. Look, we got. Maybe voting isn't that great. And, <laughs> Elect and me maybe if you're king. having a. Maybe a strong leader isn't so good. Maybe voting isn't so good. Maybe workers' rights and collectivism isn't so good. Maybe we should just go laissez faire. How about anarchy, guys? <laughs> Like, you do what you want to do, and I do what I want to do, and as long as we don't kill each other, then it's all good. Oh god, the Germans are killing us! <laughs> Why? We never saw this coming! <laughs> well, we should keep an eye on, actually, what the other people are doing. Oh god! We, we, we really should. Okay, so Italy's gone and claims on Yugoslavia. Uh, that's good for us, because um, it means they haven't gone to friend Yugoslavia. But it's not Correct. great for us. Because it yeah, means that they're... Yeah. I would have preferred they just leave the Yugoslavia alone. But that's okay. That's okay. It's assuming we can do it soon. I can't believe you're still not a fascist. I know! Give me a fascist. I'm on 32 popularity right now. Come my on. my political power is at, like, almost 250. I'm thinking I might want to just spend it here, but I know the second I spend it, no, you're going to go fascist. I, I know, I know. It's bullshit. Oh, Viscars is well, over. There, there's... There's nothing I desperate. There's nothing I desperately need right now. Um, uh, I mean, I, I wouldn't. There's a few things I wouldn't mind, but there's nothing I really need right now. Yeah, we mainly just need to save up for the different recruitment policy and war, uh, yeah. war economy. I mean, my manpower is fantastic now. I, I mean, I got militarism, and then I got the whole fascist youth thing. I'm at like of. Uh, was it uh, 43,000 manpower? Oh. So I got plenty for a country my size. I'm on 59, and I'm not going to recruit any more divisions because I'm just going to try and get over my deficit. Oh, yes! You went fascist? Fascist! Yes! Uh, Neo Empire! Right, I forgot to go Neo Ottoman Empire. Oh, that's so Neo. cool. I forgot that. That's awesome. Okay, so let us justify. Oh, so you were right. You were right. Okay, so I'm going to justify uh, to take yep. Burgas in, bulk in uh, Bulgaria. Actually, here's a question. Does it matter which ones we justify? I don't on? think it does. I've never noticed a difference. I've never noticed a difference either. I'm going to justify a Muntania in Romania. Uh, so you, maybe you do the one that's closer to you on the left side. And then I'll justify... Okay, I'll do the left side ones. I'll justify in Yugoslavia as well. Like, I don't know which one. Uh, I'll just go Macedonia. I'll just go Macedonia. It I, I, yeah, I guess we both go Macedonia because it's just the closest. Actually, is there any penalty for us both justifying the same thing? I think so. I mean, we're gonna be in the we're gonna be in the same faction by the time this en this justifies. It means two forty yeah. days. Yeah, two forty. So what'll that be? Uh, like October? Oh, I don't even know the order of the months. I grew up in the countryside. I'm an idiot. 
<laughs> I lived most of my life in the city, but hey, when when you're a disabled kid growing up in the countryside, they do not know how to teach spe special needs kids. <laughs> Who needs? You don't need to know the months. <laughs> Screw that. I didn't know how to read an analog clock until I was 16, and a friend in high school taught me. I read digital. It is kind of tricky, to be fair. It took me a while yeah, as well. I was I was a geography and history guy. I don't know none of your newfangled maths. Give me just a, give me a sundial. Yeah, yeah, give me a sundial. Actually, I had a sundial back in Dunville, back out in the countryside. Up here in Canada. <laughs> Up there. You Canadians and your friendliness and your terrible bacon. I'm as, I'm as southern as it gets for Canada. I mean, I, I pretty much live on the border with the States. I would like, love to go to Canada. It's just the fact that you I guys can, don't understand what bacon is. I can, I can wave over at uh, I can wave over at Detroit and they'll shoot back because it's Detroit. Yeah, they'll shoot back, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, that's the thing, the common misconception where they think we don't know what bacon is. It's actually the rest of the world doesn't know what air quote Canadian bacon is. First of all, they call it Canadian bacon and it's ham. Yeah. Uh, we don't sell a thing called Canadian bacon. Um, that's an American thing where they think it's our thing. So if they sell it in their cafes and call it Canadian bacon. It's not. We eat ham. And when we have bacon, when you buy bacon at the store, it's the same bacon as your country and the same bacon as the States. But we also sell a thing called female bacon, which is kind of the halfway between oh, ham and yes, bacon. That's okay. I like female bacon. That's okay. Female bacon, yeah, when people think Canadian bacon, what they're actually thinking of is female bacon, all right, which that, that's is all right. All right. I'm, I'm not the biggest fan, but when you, when you ask for bacon at a cafe or a restaurant or something, you get the same bacon you would get in the States. Yeah. Um, so it's just a common misconception. Um, there are a lot of things like that with Canada. Like, they think we say hoser as an insult. That was literally from, like, a 1970s, like, SNL sketch. It's not actually a thing we say. And also, they, they think we say, um, what was it, a boot? They think we say a boot. Actually, it's Nova Scotia says a boot. And that's where about, I think, 6% of our population lives. Yeah, but... You, it's you know, an island! You know, it's pic an island! You know Picnic Face, though. Yeah, yeah. Um, they, they, I think they, is awesome. they spread that Halifax. a lot. Halifax! Right, exactly. But they're Nova Scotians, so they spread that a lot. So. Uh, they're, I believe they're, yeah, I believe they're from Halifax. Yeah. So they, they did spread Halifax. that around. Yeah. Um, and um, don't get me wrong, I'm not ripping on uh, Nova Scotia. The Maritime Provinces or Island Provinces are some of the nicest places you can live. I wish I'd lived there. Great internet, super low living costs, insanely low crime rate. Nice. Sign me up. <laughs> I mean, I hear car crashes every day outside my wing window. Mississauga here has got, I think, the second highest uh, car crash rate in Canada. Goddamn. <laughs> Crime rate here is not great either. Unt Southern Ontario is where most people live. When you got big population density, you also have a high crime rate. It's just how it works. You know, less jobs to go around, people turn to crime, more <laughs> poverty. drive their cars into things or get their pissed off. Drive their cars into things. No one knows how to drive here because, again, like, everyone, like, we have really high immigration here from a very vast amount of country so everyone comes from places with drastically different driving laws so you got people from the middle east india spain and portugal all coming into the same area drastically different countries with different traffic laws uh italy announces claims on yugoslavian territory Ooh. Uh, at least it's okay they haven't uh... uh okay hold on uh, let's pause here for a second i'm getting an offer i need to read um the anti uh, con how do you pronounce it? Common turn pact. What? You've been you've been invited to the anti common turn pact? Yeah, okay, so let's just look at this real quick. If I join, then the German Reich likes me. Um and we like them back. Don't do it. But the Soviet Union doesn't like us. If I refuse, then all that happens is the German Reich doesn't like me very much. Yeah, don't I'm do thinking it. Screw refusal. Him. Yeah, refuse. Yeah, screw, screw him. him. Screw him. All right, I told him to fuck himself. I also got paramilitarism, and I've just started on ideological fanaticism. I'm ready nice. to unpause. Let's do it. So in 70 in days, 70 we're days we make it. And it's 24th of September is the uh, the war decks. Oh, we should start doing plans, war plans. Um, yeah, I've ar I've actually got war plans already set up on Sofia in Bulgaria. So you, what, um, you focus, like, maybe you should focus, yeah, Sofia and Yugoslavia, because all the wars are going to trigger at the same time. So, like... You need the like. You need to be main, doing the main thing in Yugoslavia and the western bit of Bulgaria, and I need to do the main thing in Romania. So that'll be fun. Oh God. I guess I guess I'll move because I I can only reach two provinces of Bulgaria. So I guess I'll move all my shit up, push Bulgaria back, and then move up straight to Romania and try and fight that out. Maybe. Yeah. 
Um, do we think we need to get our boats involved in this at all? I don't think we do. No, 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 screw that. Yeah, I'll leave him in port. I'm just gonna leave him um, and quietly rest. <laughs> I, I suck at naval combat anyway. Yeah, not a chance. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna put all my airplanes. Oh like, right man, there. I have no naval commanders. Let me hire one of those for free. I guess I should do the same, actually. I mean, it's zero political power for your first one. No Mamet Goodman. To. Thanks, Mamet. Um, okay, I'm gonna have to get a front line with Yugoslavia, too, because they're already putting tanks on the border, and, uh, I don't have tanks. Yeah. Alright, I'm, I'm, do you think it's a good idea to pick up military factory construction speed right about now? Uh, I'd say it's a bit too too late right now, honestly. I would uh, maybe... You're probably right. I should, I should go into, like, you know, infantry expert and stuff, right? Maybe something like that. Well, I, maybe go industrial concern, because you're always going to go industry techs. Oh, good point. Yeah, I'll grab that now. Do you have any more steel I can trade for you? Because I need steel. Let me see. Actually, I, I don't know how much I'm exporting. Apparently, I'm exporting negative 12. Yes, I can, what? Get, I, I can get 12 from you. <laughs> Is exporting negative 12 the same as importing 12? <laughs> no, that just means you're, it just mean, yeah, it means you're like losing from what you what you create. Okay, okay. It should it. say it shouldn't say negative, but I think it's just to make it like really clear. I guess it's a little weird. I think. All right, I've only got one general, so I'm gonna have to just kind of split up my front line here. Really, I got which like is fifteen. Nah, that's that's embellished. I got four. I was gonna say, you son of a bitch! Why do you have <laughs> fifteen? That's like some that's some like what some German shit there. Yeah, fifteen right? generals, my god. Okay, I've got eight divisions set on Bulgarian. Honestly, I think that's too many. I'm gonna promote this dude. Let's do this. I should move more of them to Yugoslavia, because Yugoslavia is going to put up way more of a fight than Bulgaria. Right, let this guy a field marshal, so let's, let's, get, let's get the field marshal. It's a good it's a good idea, by the way, to to um because these early wars, we're going to win, no problem. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, it's a good idea to have a field marshal already, even if you don't have the troops for it, because it's going to allow him to start getting up skills. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I only I only need a general's worth of troops. Oh wow! On my eastern front, Soviet Union has like thirty divisions on me. Holy crap! They do not uh, like me. I would I would be slightly concerned, although uh, we need to keep in mind that there still is. Um, yeah, they won't do what anything. What do you call it? The supply is so poor. Yeah. That also. Oh, yeah. Well, by the time an attack would happen there between your army and his army. No, no serious conflict will probably yeah, happen in that area. Fine. Um, I mean, holding a line there with the mountains and everything must be easy. I, it's only hills. I'd have to push them back to get to the mountains, but I could probably do that. Also, they're still on yeah. purge leadership, so their uh, their division strength is like massively reduced, and their organization is basically nothing. Yeah, isn't it? There's this awkward gap for them between um, between the Great Purge and and until they recover from that, where yeah. like things are really bad for a while. Pretty much, yeah. It's awful for them. All right, I've got all yeah, my troops just prepared and ready. Oh, they got like no divisions on this border. That's gonna be insane. And by insane, I mean just really sad. Yeah, I'm leaving Bulgaria largely to you. I've got like a seven division force to move in and uh, kind of yeah, hit Sofia. Yeah, you hit Sofia and then it'll capitulate pretty easily. Um, yeah, for the most part, I'm more concerned about Yugoslavia because like, can you, you can, we have shared vision, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Or no. Yeah, yeah, um, so you can see the troops they have on the border. They've actually got, like, the tanks. Of, I don't want to be too worried about tanks because I bet you anything there. Oh, pause. I've got uh, ideological fanaticism. Nice. Let's do it. What's the faction going to be called? Do I get to name it? I think so. Uh, hold on. Let, let's see here. Um, create faction. Oh, my Ooh. God. Your faction name here. Oh, my God. Shit, I wish I... Wow, you got a really handsome leader for the new Ottoman Empire. Do I? Do I receive space? I've oh, never this seen guy that model. is so charismatic! Fevi Kakmak, ooh, you dog. He, he looks very European he for does. a Turk. He looks like he's ordering a martini. He, oh my god, he looks like the, the captain of a yacht. He looks like the captain of a yacht who, like, gets laid more than the person who owns the yacht. You know what I mean? You know, I've never seen the love boat, but I bet you anything he's the conductor. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what are we going to call it? What are we going to call it? Uh, says they will not accept, I think, otherwise, video game. Send. Oh god, what is it, what is it? The Nationalist... Okay. 
La- <laughs> Love really, boat. you should have been the leader of this one. Oh, <laughs> man. Yes. Wait a minute. I just realized something. My general is just your general with a different color of shirt and yours has a hat on. No, mine has a mustache. Mine, no, but my, my leader is a different guy, but my general in my army oh, really? is the same guy, but without a I'm hat. the same person. We're the same person. Oh, we get an event. <gasps> Fame for its strength and its superiority. Ooh. Oh my god. About the love. There are boat. other missions. It's so good. Nice. Alright, national focus. I should probably go industrial effort, but should I maybe jump into army effort? I don't know. I've gone um I've got militarism because my my uh manpower is really low. But I would go armament effort for military factories, definitely. Yeah, because we're so close to taking a bunch of oh, factories. You, you got anyway. like you got like no troops. Holy shit. I know, right? It's been rough, and I've been producing the whole time. It's just, it's slowed down so much by my, um, yeah. Uh, my, yeah. My, I, I got a deficit of infantry equipment. I'm really trying to catch up on it. Damn. Uh, Actually, you, what, you know what I should do now? I should switch out some of my infantry with artillery now uh, to make up for that, because I've got a stockpile of artillery. I'm not sure if you have enough. No, well, I did it, so let's see if that bites <laughs> me. You can, you can see when you <laughs> replace it, you can see how many you need. Uh, if you change, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it on my screen, but no one can see. But you know, it shows you like how much you need and like how, what it will be in the storage. Oh my God! Hit F9 and zoom out. The world is right again. Love both. <laughs> this is this is the it's only so good. this is the only way we look at the map now. Oh my God! We're the love. I like the color too. It's how it's, uh, the lead. it's the leader color, so it's like that really nice, like kind of sky blue thing. I love God, it. God, the love boat is perfect. I'm ready to unpause, by the way. Let's do this, but man. The, lo the love boat is bigger than the Axis. Oh, it's huge. <laughs> I mean, the Axis is probably going to get a lot bigger than the love boat a lot oh, faster. Yeah. But, but it's okay, because no, 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 we're going to get Yugoslavia, Romania, and Bulgaria in about two, six months. So don't you worry. I mean. The allies are the... Uh, well, actually, no. Uh, no, the allies might be the biggest. I don't know the land difference between um, common turn and uh, allies, because allies have a lot of Africa, and they got all of Canada. Yeah, but, but who the not, Soviet who, but, Union at this yeah. point in history was enormous. Like, Russia's still the biggest country nowadays, but they had so much more back then. They did. Like, this is all Georgian shit in the Circassian region. Yeah. Do you want to go oh, Max Oh, my God, it is. Yeah, I'm. I'm good for it. Um, nice. it's insane how big Russia was at the time. Oh, no. But dry bread is lagging behind. Ah! Oh my god! You suck. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and say that's a that's poor net code on the yeah. on the case of the game rather than my internet. It's fine. Still way better net code than half the games I play. Yeah. Improved machine tools done. Nice. nice and nice, I've nice. got. Oh, and concentrated industry done. I don't think I should bother with construction too. Should I? Uh, Am I no, really going to get anything out of Just keep going. It? Keep going down to armament effort. You need the military factories. They're way better. No, no. I mean um, construction to oh, like in research. Uh, maybe. Should I get? Should I get radio actually? Possibly. That is pretty damn useful. And support weapons one. That's good. Yeah, definitely. For when we start getting yeah. fighting other people. Uh, considering we're about to get in a fight, I should really get that. Yeah. Right. God, mechanical computing is always an annoying one because decryption is really nice, but mechanical computing itself takes forever. Right. Fuck it, I'll do it. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to fall behind on decryption and encryption. It takes because so that, long, though. That's my problem. It takes, it takes forever, but the advantage in combat is significant. Yeah. I think I think we're gonna do fine. I think we're gonna get a crap ton oh, yeah. of extra factories. So we just hit the half an hour mark here. Yeah. The Neo Ottoman Empire and the oh God, what was it? National Union of Greece. It's a sentence long. <laughs> have have joined forces to become the Love Boat or the Love Boat. Ove, oh, there we go. Now it's Love Boat. For a second, it was Ove Boat because <laughs> there were a bunch of army symbols in the way. And on the next episode, I bet you on the next episode we're gonna start our wars. Oh yeah, definitely. Not not even a doubt. We won't. All right, so uh, I, I guess you can do your outro. Oh, I'm so excited! I'm so excited. Are you ready? You gonna are you ready for this? I think I'm. I think I'm ready. I was Aldra Hill, and I will continue to be. That's right. And it's been Hearts of Iron Four, the Love Boat, with my dry bread. Thanks for watching. I'll I'll also be me later, just so you know. Yeah, yeah, that's good. <laughs> I want to make sure that you'll be you, because it's you gotta you gotta let people know. All right. Bye-bye. <laughs>